I want to talk about gratitude today. Gratitude, because it's it's one of those things that's kind of um, expanded around a lot. You know, be grateful for what you have. Be grateful for everything. And I know that can be really, really tough when things are hard. You know, when things are going hard, it's really hard to be to be grateful for things when you're in this kind of negative spiral. I know I felt the same um, when I read about it, but actually gratitude is such a powerful, it's a simple and powerful tool. And I think sometimes with this stuff that is simple, we can almost dismiss it because it's so simple and we think, oh, well, that's not going to do anything. If I do that every day, that's not going to do much because it's not this, this big moment it's not this big thing that we're doing you know maybe when you do exercise you get the endorphins running you you feel that energy don't you and maybe these sort of smaller practices like gratitude like mindfulness and like meditation they can feel like they're not going to have much of an effect but actually when you look over time when you start doing these things and implement the, implementing these things daily into your life then they can make such a huge difference And that's what I'm about. I'm about these small, really simple daily habits that you can just put into your life really simply. I don't want it to become like a a to-do list, something else that you need to do that day that you start like worrying about. And I think gratitude is something that is quite simple to add in any way you can. I know know a lot of people like to add it to a morning practice. Um, you know, some people like to have pages where they, they journal and literally, you know, will write down things that they're grateful for in the morning. Um, there's, you know, there's all sorts of different ways you could do that. You can do that maybe at the beginning of a meditation, the end of a meditation, maybe just throughout the day. I like to, um, every day I have a, I have a crystal by the side of my bed. So I hold the crystal and I hold it to my heart. It could be anything, it doesn't have to be a crystal as well. And I go through the day and I say to myself, what things am I grateful for that day? Or what big wins did I have? And I've been doing this for a while now and it's been really nice to notice and see that there's always something, every single day. No matter how I think the day's gone, if, I, if it's been a bit of a struggle that day or I've not done much or don't feel like I've done much, I just have a little moment where I go, right, what have you done today? And it could be the smallest thing. It doesn't have to be big things. You know, it could literally be, oh, I had a shower. <laughs> and that was great. You know, it could be anything. It, could, it doesn't have to be big things. And I think once you start doing that, and once you start doing that daily, as much as you can, you really slowly begin to shift your perspective into a more positive mindset. So then you go, oh, wow, actually, yeah, I did think I had a quite bad day. But now I've just thought about things that I did do. Wow. And I know I've done this so I've done this so many times where I've just been like, oh, God, I've I've not been very productive. You know, in this world that, you know, it's, it's all about working hard, being productive, you know, doing things and stuff. And sometimes it's pulling back on that and recognizing actually all the small things as well. All the small things you did that day. Maybe maybe somebody just smiled at you. And you were like, oh, that's nice. <laughs> There's just so many beautiful things that happen in the world. And it's starting to become aware of them and notice them and be grateful for those small things that we have in the world. I know a really good practice, if you are unsure what to think, sometimes you think, well, what, what am I grateful for? What do I have? Sometimes you just look at the, literally look at the things around you. Look at the things around you. What do you have? Okay. Now imagine you don't have those things. So now you know, I might imagine I don't have my phone or I don't have my car. Well, what would that be like? Okay, yeah, that would be, that would be hard. Yeah, I would struggle, you know, um, to stay in contact. I would, you know, stay in contact with my family and friends. So it's about shifting that and recognizing why you are grateful for them. And you can journal on this as well. You can just journal on gratitude, why you're grateful for these things. And it just starts to really slowly bring this this shift of perspective into your, into the forefront of your mind and to a slightly more positive outlook. Doesn't mean you're going to get rid of completely the negative, the so-called negative um, stuff, but it just helps. It just helps bring a little light into your world daily. So that's what I have to say on gratitude. Thank you.